What's going on guys? How are you meeples? Today we're going to be showing you the brand new Crystal Axe Wonder Weapon within DLC 4 Forsaken and Cold War Zombies. This thing is amazing. This has been a joy to use in the map. By far, one of my only reasons, not to say the map is bad because it absolutely is not, right now at least, who knows in the future, right? Because there's always a honeymoon phase no matter what map you're playing. You never know until um, after the fact, right? Um... This Wonder Weapon, my point is that this Wonder Weapon is a reason alone to come back and play this map because it is just so frigging powerful, so good, so much fun. It's an axe, it's in some kind of like SMG Wonder Weapon shooting gun. You can pack a puncher three times as you, as, as you just saw right there. I went up to it, I don't have enough points right here. I'll go ahead and proceed a little bit further into the video, this way you can see a little bit better. Um, but as you, there you go. It just absolutely shreds. This is only tier one pack a punch uh, right here. It's only round 17, but this thing absolutely decimates. And this is during the dragon, so the zombies do have a bit more health when you do this. Um, it shreds. And another important thing to mention is that if you have your melee tier upgraded to tier five, you actually get back some health when you melee zombies. So, for example, if you're at 150 health and you melee the zombies, you can just look at my health bar as I'm meleeing and, and getting hit. It, it goes back up. Um, I'm not exactly sure by what percentage the the melee tier is in Cold War Zombies. So obviously in Cold War Zombies, there's the skills and there's a melee skill that you can upgrade. Um, as you guys know, some of them give one of them gives you a one hit melee for a, for a, like uh, until like round 14 in the game, right? But a, without any other melee weapon, you have a one hit melee until round 14. Um, one of those tiers actually gives you some health, uh, some health bonus by getting kills. And my point is that with the Crystal Axe, that is insanely awesome because especially at the higher rounds the zombies will start to run a little bit quicker um and you definitely will get hit um and as such it may get annoying with a traditional melee weapon but not with the crystal axe because this thing is powerful and even if you get hit you'll get that health right back by just meleeing some zombies it is awesome now <clears throat> excuse me this is a nocturne and totem little mini easter egg in here um now moving into kind of like the abilities of the wonder weapon this is just us messing around with stuff the abilities of the Wonder Weapon, um, you can go ahead and just melee it like usual. Use it as a regular melee weapon by pressing R2, whatever your regular, you know, shooting button is. Um, and if you do that, it'll swing left, it'll swing right. That's just one normal kind of, like, shot of it, right? L you, you press the trigger, it'll swing left, swing right, if it's in the axe form, obviously. Now, if it's in the axe form, and you press the left trigger, which on the controller would be L2, obviously, that would go ahead and throw out the axe. Now... This ability does not always work, you'll notice, and the reason why, and you notice right here, I just destroyed this boss uh, with the the abomination with this SM, with the SMG version of the gun. But the reason why the L2 ability of the axe doesn't work is actually because it's not charged. <laughs> nice little throw clear. Um, but yeah, the thing has to be charged, and you may be saying, what the heck does that mean? I have ammo on the gun, what's going on? Well, you'll notice that as you kill zombies with the Crystal Axe, you'll begin to get some drops specific to the Crystal Axe. And when you pick up these drops, some of them, re I'm not sure if there's, I'm actually not sure if there's a distinction between the ammo drops or the energy drops. All I know is that you have to pick up drops to go ahead and charge the weapon. When you do, you can use this L2 ability in which you could throw out your axe, and you can even hold down your left trigger and have it spin there for a minute if you want. Not for a whole minute, but you, for a good 10 to 15 seconds, you can leave an actual axe out there spinning. So imagine throwing the Hell's Retriever, but the button you use to throw it, right? You hold it, and the Retriever stays out spinning. So if you combine that with you're also able to use the axe ability, you're able to use the R2 ability while holding down the L2 ability. While it's down spinning, you can still use the actual axe version of it. It is insanely, insanely powerful, even without the L2 ability, right? Without the spinning axe, without being able to throw the axe at all, it is really good. But if you pair those two together with an insane camping spot, the axe alone is insane, right? I just I just wanted to <clears throat> go ahead and talk about that um, because I thought it was very important. Some people may see gameplay of it and they see people throwing the axe, but they don't understand why. Um, some people may see gameplay of it and they see zombies explode when the gun's in SMG form. They see people shooting zombies and some zombies are exploding. What's going on there? Well, that's the Crystal Axe. That's the SMG version of the gun. When you switch it to an SMG, or just, we'll just say a gun, right? When you switch it to a gun and, shoot it and start shooting the zombies, some of the bullets have a chance to actually, uh, infect the zombies in a sense and explode, cause a little explosion. Now, it's nothing insane, but it definitely does a decent job and kills 
the zombies within very close proximity. Uh, I don't know what's going on here. I'm coughing. I'm burping. I'm dying. I don't know what's going on here. Um, but yeah, it's it's really fun to use. It is a very very powerful wonder weapon. This wonder weapon alone, regardless of how good Mauer's, uh, I keep saying Mauer. Regardless of how good Forsaken's Easter egg winds up being, regardless of how good the map is after the honeymoon phase, this wonder weapon alone, considering there's no nerfs, bearing there's no nerfs, will be a reason alone to come back to the map. It is one of those wonder weapons that is that seemingly in the higher echelon of wonder weapons. It is extremely unique. It is extremely fun, and uh, I'm just I'm I'm grateful that we have something really really new in cold war zombies to dive into sure we have the ray k with its own abilities and stuff like that hold on i'm just loading up more gameplay for you guys um but <clears throat> let me go ahead and mute this for you as well um it's great having you know other wonder weapons cold war zombies like the ray k like the servers and stuff like that but this is one of the more unique wonder weapons within cold war um, as you can see right there, there you go. There's me throwing the axe out and holding down the button, the left trigger button, and it's staying there. Um, that's awesome. And again, that ju that ju that's just a testament to what I was just saying about it being extremely unique. Nothing like any of the other wonder weapons that we've had. If anything, it combines older concepts we had before with this brand new concept of wonder weapon, right? The Hell's Retriever, you're able to hold it out there now. Like, it's just, it's awesome. Um, other than that, I don't think there's much else to mention right you can change it to your smg form how exactly you change that would be the same way you switch the firing modes on the right okay there you go that right there again was me pressing down i actually have a few more things to say that right there was me pressing down the l2 button and actually just letting it just holding down the button and letting it sit there that was that um but yeah in terms of the smg form it's fairly good as well i haven't tested it on really high rounds so i don't really know but the axe i think is going to be the way to go either way but both have seemingly been pretty damn solid um so that covers that i explained the l2 ability holding that down now in terms of actually using the special abilities of this wonder weapon not that they're completely crazy but they're great if you know if you use them in the right situations one of them activates automatically um but my point is that in order to actually get them at all you need to have charge in the wonder weapon now you may be asking how do i get charge it's very simple you must kill zombies um and eventually I, I'm not exactly sure if it's the ammo drops that charge the gun as well as give you ammo or if it's just killing zombies But I believe you have to also pick up these energy shots these energy these things right here As you can see a volatile crystals. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if there's distinctions in the crystals you get I don't believe there are so as long as you pick those up. You'll be fine um, Either way killing zombies will get you charged even if you have to pick them up kill zombies pick them up. You'll be good There you go um, but there, once the thing actually is charged and again the reason why it's so hard to tell right now the map just came out um, is that we there's no indication that the weapon is charged to our knowledge right even if you ha are ready to go to shoot out the extra special ability of the uh, of the axe right for example you throw it out there's no way of telling when that ability is available except for you doing it and it working same thing with the actual gun you'll notice right there I'm shooting a zombie it'll freeze and eventually it'll explode I think you have to shoot it for it to explode. And that is something similar to the ability of the Ray K, but with way less tediousness involved. You don't have to shoot the orb. You don't have to shoot out an orb. You don't have to switch firing modes to shoot the orb again. It's just perfect. There you go right there, actually. That was a special energy crystal, as you saw. Um, it was it was purple. It was glowing. I picked it up, and bang. Um, that that kind of refilled the weapon. I believe those are, the ammo and the energy is, are, are connected. I think they're the same crystal. Again, I don't know. It's, it's a little unclear. It's a little confusing. Um, but either way, just get kills, pick up as many crystals as you can. If the L2 ability is not working, just know that's what you have to do. Um, <clears throat> but, yeah, it is it is it is freaking awesome. There's just not much to say. I'm just trying to make sure I have all the grounds covered. I know I may have repeated a few things, but I just wanted to sit here and explain and really let you watch the gameplay um, and let just things happen. Talk about this brand new Wonder Weapon because it really is a masterpiece. I, I, I don't really sit down and talk about the Wonder Weapons like this. Just talking to you guys like this in this format. I usually make a video about it all serious and stuff like that But I needed to make a video just talking to you about it because it genuinely is a really fun wonder weapon It gave me that awesome feeling um, that I haven't had in zombies in a while again regardless of the map I'm not saying the map is bad. I'm not saying it's amazing. I'm not saying anything about the map at all I'm just saying that the Krizlax wonder weapon is awesome in itself um, with all its abilities so again to sum up in order, there's two different ways you can use this gun, either as an SMG slash just a regular gun, right? Or as an axe. In its SMG form, in the gun form, you can go ahead and you can throw, uh, or sorry, 
in, in its gun form, you can actually go ahead and just shoot the zombies like a regular gun, whatever you want to do, right? I believe Deadshot also works, although it's a Wonder Weapon. I don't even think Deadshot applies to Wonder Weapons, but whatever. Um, it still snaps onto the zombies just fine. It does its thing. You sh use it as a regular gun. Um, whenever the gun has charge, whenever the weapon has charge within it, um, you have a chance at activating this kind of explosive zombie. And as such, when you shoot it again, it will explode and, and kill zombies within a radius. Another just unique ability on top of having, you know, energy bullets, energy wonder weapon bullets, which is awesome. Now, transitioning over to the axe, in order to switch over to the axe, you just press up on your D-pad pretty much or whatever it is on PC uh, to switch firing modes. I'm not sure what that would be. Um, but once you switch on over to the axe, you can go ahead and melee zombies once you just press your, your, your shoot button, whatever that may be. It swings left, it swings right. That counts as one full swing. It doesn't take away any ammo, by the way, to use that at all. Um, just thought I'd mention that, but yeah. Um, it's really, really awesome. Um, and then in terms of the, the, you have the regular swing ability, then you have the L2 ability of the axe, which is the just the left trigger button. And that's where you can actually throw the axe and just, uh, nice, and just let it hang out there. And it's just, it's just awesome. I think I'm trying to activate it right here and it didn't work. I just got a crystal. Let me see. Um, and again, in order to have those special abilities activate, aka the explosive, uh, the, where you shoot the, shoot the zombies with a regular bullet gun and with a regular bullet wonder weapon and one zombie is, it gets like infest, infected and explodes. In order to get that and the L2 ability where you can actually throw the axe and hold it if you want to, hold it out there and let it spin a little bit. Um, you must have charge on the weapon and to get that charge you have to get kills You may also have to collect crystals that is still unclear on what exactly causes this weapon to be Charged I do wish Treyarch did a little bit of a better job at, uh, at, at Flushing that out, but either way um, The abilities aren't groundbreaking. Um, I mean for that matter. They can just be RNG right the base the way the weapons work at all is amazing the other those other two abilities are just kind of like bonuses on top so if their abilities aren't working just keep getting kills um collecting crystals whatever it may be and um you will it'll be charged to be able to use and or we should say harness those special abilities um that's pretty much it a lot of fun you will definitely enjoy the wonder weapon whether you enjoy the map we'll have to wait and see what the easter eggs like we'll have to wait and see what the side of your are, are like and stuff like that definitely some interesting things going on and, uh, yeah, stay tuned for the most elite guides on the YouTube. That is the Crystal Axe Wonder Weapon explained fully in depth. Had stuff repeated multiple times, but you got the whole picture here. You got a genuine sit-down talk about the Crystal Axe Wonder Weapon. And hell, yeah, baby. Um, take care of your meatballs, my friends. Peace.